Right, very short video. I've just climbed up the very steep path down from Cheddar, up from Cheddar. Um, I'm on a walk to Velvet Bottom, a bit of the west of the uh, air of outstanding beauty. <sighs> and then back through Piney Slides. It's going to be a hot day. It's already hot. Um, this Glastonbury Tour over there, look. There's only video in it, the other from different angles, it sticks out from everywhere, really. And it's uh, it's quarter to eleven already. I've just stopped, had a drink, cooled off, and uh, took my jumper off. I'm not going to go right close to the gorge. I've taken photos loads of times of the gorge. Basically, this is. Um, I decided to come up the steep side um, at the start of the walk. I don't, I'm not too keen going down yet, believe it or not. I'm going to go down the gentle path when I come back. So, let me see, I've got... I haven't really got that much time, actually. I'll have to pet by ear, but I'm doing Velvet Bottom. And then I'm going to see what the time's like, if I have to change direction at all. Over and out. Over and out, everyone. Right, I had a little picnic, just a tiny one, on the big stone, overlooking the reservoir. Here I've got beautiful views of the gorge. I'm on the north side this week. Not long ago I was over that side. Could be two weeks ago, I don't know, I lose track of time actually. I'm out all the time, so... I might not have placed that one on yet. I, uh, I usually place photos. So here I am. I'm on this side. Young couple just ahead of me. They'll, they'll disappear fast. They're young. They're not carrying any rucksacks or gear. I didn't even see that they had any water. I've seen one big group of people. None of them had anything on their backs. None of them had any water. And that was a whole family that... I thought, God, you're, you're going to really want water going around this course, even though it's only three miles. It's a very, um, it can be very demanding. And there is absolutely nowhere you can get a drink. Someone hasn't thought of that yet, coming down. They might have to get a licence. Anyway, so I'm walking along the north side of the gorge. And look at the array of beautiful trees we've got. It's not insect stinging time yet. But there will be adders about. Yeah, there will be adders about today. Most of them steer clear of people. I missed one not long ago. Big long one it was actually. It, it, it could have been a grass snake, but I think it was an adder. It just, it had been on a pathway over Roborrow, and then it just disappeared into the bushes before I could take a picture. It was that quick. It saw, it heard my feet. I think they hear you, the, the vibrations. I would have got some, I'd love to, I have never taken a picture of an adder. I bet it would be nicer to see one sat in here now, wouldn't it? You're not amongst these. They'll be in there. That's why you should best keep your tracks. I mean, if I got stung by one, bitten by one now, I've got my antihistamine tablets and cream, and I'd have to put that on first to try and help. And um, painkillers, I've got all that with me. And then, um, oh, 999. <sighs> but anyway, we don't want to... Th well, you do have to think of it, actually. And I'm not taking any more risks with cows though, because I did take a big risk with a... 
Well, but the majority of the cows had already gone down the field. There was about six that were lurking. And I did walk through them. And they did follow me to the gate. But I managed to get over. But they were big, strong, black bullocks. They were... You know, you can't fall out with them sort of thing. Somebody coming along, bloke on his own. I'll just turn off a minute. Right, onward. Just met two people. They're obviously, they're just carrying water. They're just carrying water. I'm only videoing a bit. Little snippets. I do it a lot. People are who follow me to think, oh, not another gorge walk. What they've got to realise is that not everyone has seen the originals. <laughs> and the event's different. And now the Queen has been down in Cornwall at the Eden Project, where the summit of the seven have been meeting about <coughs> climate change and stuff. And, um... The Queen's been hosting President Biden and his wife. Um, I, I, I think shit, they, they might might have even gone to the castle. I'm not sure if they did go to Winter Castle, but they all did meet up at um, the Eden Project down in Cornwall. Cornwall's been overtaken by thousands of police and army just so that they can uh, protect. I mean, it was a good spot in many ways, but think about it, because... Um, it's deep down there. Because it's a peninsula down the bottom, and it could be patrolled by naval boats. The water, as you see. You've got the River Tamar, you could stop anyone crossing over the river, boats patrolling the seas, but of course Little St Ives has never seen anything like it in its existence, I don't think, <clears throat> apart from when the pirates raided in the 16th century and took off some of their people. Um, uh, Yes, but it's probably, I don't know if it was good for the economy or not, if, it, if tourists couldn't really get in there. I don't even know what the outcome of is that meeting yet. No one's really discussed it. Now the Euro started, football, and England won yesterday against Croatia. Now they're a tough team. But they're an older team. They have... Uh, ours are a very young team. Very young. One was only 17 in our team. But they have more mature, experienced players, Croatia. And it was... Well, I thought we did really well the whole game, actually. We didn't struggle. So we're through to another section. So are Croatia. It's just the first round. But we've got Croatia out the way early. So I think they'll be, I think they'll beat their, their next opponents, Croatia, and then you never know, we could end up facing them again. Anyway, that's football for you. Today, Scotland are playing at one o'clock, two o'clock. I'm not watching that match. I didn't watch the Welsh one because I've got to get out in this beautiful weather. You know, I've got to get out. Tonight is a match remember it is now but it could be Northern Ireland I'm not sure but there is a match on tonight at 7 they're on all the time about 3 matches a day in the first round and England will be playing again I don't I don't can't remember who they're playing next um, but of course the Euros were cancelled last year because of the COVID-19 epidemic but they're still calling it 
2020, Euro 2020. So it's supposed to have been last year, you see, and it was all cancelled. Football changed a lot. Um, very few... I mean, 15,000 spectators, say, only, compared to, say, 65,000. Lots of spacing. It's easier for the police to control the crowds, actually, as well, if you think about it. People will stick out more if they try to cause trouble. Um, yeah, we had some, we've got some Chelsea footballers in our team, in our England team. They take them from various clubs. Uh, so I think that's the main news going on at the moment. Over and out. Right. I keep bumping into people, so I have to turn off. There's about five people coming up behind me now. They're coming down the steps at the moment. They caught up quick. Right, I'm coming through a little copse. <coughs> Which one I take? Oh, more people coming. Don't stop. Right, turn it on. Here we are. Where are we? Right, we're walking through this little copse. And every time I put the, the red button on to record, somebody comes. A lot of people are doing the circular, see? They're going from um, Cheddar up Jacob's Ladder and up along the south side. And they come to this and in a minute they got the steps. So I'm just doing a little bit of video in here and there. Just so not too big a gap between areas. And of course I compliment them with photos. Complimented with photos. They said it was going to be windy and I thought, oh, I don't like the wind, but that's in the winter. In the summer, nearly summer, 21st to be summer, um, it's actually very good to have a wind. It cools you. Because in that sun, it's quite hot and I've got a, quite a lot of exposed walking to do yet for a long time. There'll be a lot of it. Little patches of trees here and there where you can get out of the sun and I'll be reaching the midday sun I should think any minute now I'm videoing as I go little bits and pieces which have been videoed before There's people coming up and down the steps. You can see the steps. And I'll just zoom in. Just through that gap there, there's the steep steps. Over there, look. Not very close, it's the focus. There's people coming now. People coming. Loads of them. You've caught that one, me. I told you that, didn't I? As soon as um, I can't sit down, see, because uh, there's loads of them coming. Over and out. <sighs> 